Welcome back. I'm here with the President of Veterans for Peace Local Chapter, Tim Keenan, and Executive Director of the NMC Foundation, Rebecca Keenan. Welcome both of you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so much for being here. First of all, for those, those folks out there who've never heard of Veterans for Peace, what exactly is this organization? Uh, Veterans for Peace actually began in 1985 okay. by a bunch of uh, actually Vietnam vets uh, out of Portland, Maine. And it's now grown into 120 chapters throughout the country. Only, only 120. Only 120. <laughs> and, uh, you know, we're, uh, we ed- we'd like to educate the community on the cost, the human cost of war, as well as the monetary cost of war. And, of course, the big thing we do is we like to support the troops, mm-hmm. big time support the troops and their families. That's kind of what the scholarship is all about, is supporting a veteran or a child of a vet with this $1,000 scholarship to NMC each year. Very, very important. Now, can you fill us in on this scholarship? I mean, this is this is wonderful. It is. We're so grateful to Tim and organizations like Veterans for Peace um, who have chosen NMC to support um, students in our community. Uh, these types of opportunities for our students really can be life-changing. Life-changing. Absolutely. Access to higher education and just... And we, we hear tremendous stories of students that have truly turned their lives around thanks to a helping hand like this scholarship provides. Yeah, and it may not seem like much to some, but for those who really need it. It really makes a difference. It absolutely does. And NMC is a really affordable option for higher education, a quality mm-hmm. higher education. But like you said, every bit helps, um, especially when you think of a lot of our students uh, may be working second jobs, may be raising right. families, may be single parents. You just never know. So. Absolutely. A $1,000 scholarship can go a long way. Long way. Now, you have a really great event uh, coinciding with the, the art and war that's going on right now. Mm-hmm. That's a very uh, the Ben Bush pictorial documentary. It's, it's very thought-provoking, very moving. It can, to me, it was very sad. I'm an infantry veteran. I'm sure all veterans that see this and even people that aren't veterans can watch this. Right. See this, they'll, they'll see some uh, things that uh, just make them think. And you're going to have other activities um, while people enjoy this as well? We are. We're going to have uh, really, really good food. And <laughs> always a draw. We'll always. always a draw. We've got some people that are really preparing some really good food. And uh, we'll, we'll have a cash bar. Of course, we have a silent auction. Which, which the community has is, is really reached out to us and helped us in so many ways. We've got so many good things to auction off. And uh, mm-hmm. it's, it's going to be a really good event. And, of course, we have music. We have the uh, string band from Traverse City West High School. Nice. They're very good. And we have uh, uh, one of our veterans, uh, the Steve Little Trio's jazz band. They're going to play for a couple hours, so dancing. It please. sounds like it's going to be a great yeah. night. Thank you both so much for coming. Um, you, if you'd like to attend the Veterans for Peace Scholarship event, again, it will be Saturday, June 16th. Mark your calendar. It will be the Dennis Museum Center from 7 to 10 p.m. This is also, again, coinciding with the end of the exhibition, The Art of War Photographs from U.S. Marine Benjamin Bush. Tickets are $20, just $20 or $15 for students and seniors, and you can call the number on your screen for more information.